Tim, a 3-0 win tonight against Roddy United. You must be very happy with the night's work. Yeah, obviously, listen, the result's the most important thing, Jamie. Um, I thought the first half we were excellent. Um, continued on the performance from the last two games, probably. Um, and then, obviously, the way it went last week in Valley Buffet, we'd only had one goal lead. It got a little bit edgy, probably to start the second half for 15 minutes or so. Um, but listen, late on, then we got a couple of more goals that made it easier right at the end. But again, 3-0, clean sheet, uh, and three points is, is, uh, is all it needed. Yeah, the opener from Billy King, a <coughs> third goal in three games now, but the ball from Jack Scott, but how Chris Forrester kept that live at the back post? Yeah, again, listen, we're asking the lads to probably fill the box a bit more, and you've seen before that, you see Ben McCormick filling the box and getting a great header and hit the inside of the post, and uh, same then again with, with Kyle when he came on, he put a great ball into the back post and Mark Doyle and got a good finish as well, so yeah, Chrissy kept it alive and, <laughs> and Billy showed a bit of composure as well, so it was good. Yeah, ninth league goal this season for Owen Doyle as well, he's closing in on double figures but the role of Tunde had only come on in the build up as well pace and power and a great ball across the box and probably one of the easiest goals Doyle will ever score yeah that's it um, and Doyle will say it himself he probably should have a good few more goals as well so um, but again you're looking at him he's 50 something games this season so far so we have to try and manage it um, and listen we're pleased we're pleased with the, the three attacking players on the pitch really Billy Mark Doyle and uh, Owen Doyle getting the goals and um, obviously the subs that come on impacted as well Tunde set one up and Kyle set one up as well so uh, that's all you have to ask for and a clean sheet at the other end as well. I mean, you mentioned that start to the second half when Drada looked like they, they might go and get something. So again, at the back to resilience and, and a clean sheet. And that rain as well, quite difficult for Joe Anning at times to deal with stuff given how bad the conditions were. Yeah, considering the start of the game, it's dry pitch. And then the end of the game, it's absolutely saturated. So yeah, he dealt with a few things that came his way. But um, another clean sheet. That's, I think it's double figures for clean sheets in the league for Joe. So um, that's pleasing. Overall, a good night's work. A rest week next <coughs> weekend in terms of no league game, but I think there might be a friendly organised. And then Dundalk at home, Europe, the FAI Cup, so a big few weeks ahead. Yeah, it's busy, it's busy, so we'll, um, we'll crack on now for, for the coming week, um, hopefully get an in-house game um, next Saturday and then prepare for the knock. Well done, Tim, thank you. Cheers.